you're told it would be beneficial to have your crawl space encapsulated. You then say, we have a vapor barrier. Isn't that good enough? It's easy to be confused. Vapor barriers and encapsulation have some similarities. Stay tuned to hear how they're different. Hi, I'm Nolan Beery and I'm the Director of Sales at AccuLevel. I've been around the foundation business since my family started AccuLevel in 1996. I began working full-time at AccuLevel in 2013. Vapor barriers and encapsulation are used for some of the same reasons. In this video, I'll tell you what a vapor barrier is and what encapsulation is. I will also let you know which one you might need in your home. Let's get started. Vapor barrier is traditionally a five or a six mil plastic that you can simply find in a roll from your local hardware store. This is a plastic that you lay down on the dirt of your crawl space and it's there to keep the majority of the moisture between the bottom of the plastic and the ground. Without it, the moisture simply just rises, sits on your wooden subfloor and can cause a lot of wood rot, biological growth and other nasty smells. Encapsulation is taking vapor barrier to the next level. It's much thicker, usually sitting at a 16 mil plastic that's usually interwoven with either nylon or virgin plastic. It's meant to be more durable and withstand the common replacement of plumbing, electrical, and anything else that you might have someone in the crawl space for. The other major benefit to encapsulation is it's gonna go all the way up the walls. It's gonna wrap all your columns and seal the space completely off from moisture underneath your crawl space or underneath your home. Here at AccuLevel, we think that encapsulation is a must have for every homeowner. Since a majority of the air that you breathe comes from the crawl space, this is an extremely important piece to protecting your home long term. Now, encapsulation can be more costly than a normal vapor barrier and it helps your wood maintain its strength by blocking out any moistures that may damage it. And so at a very minimum, we de definitely recommend you have a vapor barrier to help keep that to somewhat of a minimum, even though it's not gonna take care of all that moisture in the crawl space. If you have issues with your crawl space or foundation, give us a call to schedule an appointment with one of our project advisors. You can also go to our homepage, acculevel.com, and click the book a consultation button in the top right corner. Fill out the form and we'll contact you within the next business day. Do you have questions about your home's crawl space? If so, please leave them in the comments below and we'll be happy to answer those questions for you. Check out the description for more videos and blog articles on crawl space and foundation repair. We noticed that about 99% of the people who watch our videos are not subscribed. So if you could take a quick second hit that like and subscribe button, we would greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching.